Hey everyone, welcome back to Everything Marvel DC, and this is the last Harley Quinn review of Season 2. And in this video, I'm reviewing the last two episodes, since I haven't been uh, watching these episodes weekly, so I haven't made weekly reviews of them. That's also the same thing I'm doing with Stargirl right now. I'm reviewing all the episodes I've missed at once, in one video, that way it's faster. But let's talk about the ending of Harley Quinn. I really enjoyed the ending. Harley Quinn started for, uh, in uh, Season 1. It started with a like more like a sitcom more of the it gave me the the Simpsons and Family Guy vibes I'm, I'm not quite a huge fan of those so that's why I've been like on both sides on on Harley Quinn whether I like it whether I like it or I don't like it but I really en enjoyed these last two episodes but I really enjoyed the plot and all of those and all of the things it's actually nice to see Psycho getting like psycho being the main plot i i i I, uh, I think i always enjoyed psycho so it's actually really great to see him being the main villain he's huge in this in these two last episodes so i guess now with the just league back uh, new new gotham isn't really a thing anymore it's back to the old gotham which sure i'm 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 happy for gotham itself but what kind of I, I am disappointed about on uh, how they did New New Gotham, like, they could have done more, I think, they were really, what's the word, safe with New New Gotham, it wasn't No Man's Land, it was, or it, it was, but we didn't get to see much of it, much of it was just normal Gotham without the Just League. And I really enjoyed Darkseid, he, I hope Darkseid is going to play a big part in Season 3, it's kind of hinted that, at that. So I hope that Darkseid is going to be, like, maybe, uh, probably not m the main villain, but one of the big villains in Season 3. You know, it was kind of hinted at that. And Harley and Ivy is back together. I'm really glad that Ivy wasn't the one who left uh, Kite Man. It's, it's Kite Man that left Harley, uh, Ivy. Because I, I always said that I would love for Harley and Ivy to come to, to, come to be together. But I don't want Kite Man to be hurt, so I'm really glad that that the uh, that the the creators, that the writers of the show, made so Kite Man left Ivy. It's not Ivy's fault. That that way, I don't feel bad for him, because otherwise, if Harley left him, I would feel bad, because I will I will really like Kite Man. So I'm glad that they made the decision to make Kite Man dump Ivy, and not uh, not the opposite. And I also really hope that Joker is getting is is season three. He is getting more humane, is that right? Now he's no longer the always killing and he's not really the Joker anymore, but he still is the Joker if, if you know what I mean. But yeah, I think that was it for this video. There isn't very much to say actually, so if you if you enjoyed this video, leave a like, subscribe, join my Discord server, and uh, yeah, everything will be down in the description. You can also follow my social medias and everything, everything in down in the description. Subscribe to my new YouTube channel, everything like that. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.